G'day, here's a very curious question for middle schoolers, and it goes as follows. A ship travels from point A to point B along a semi-circular path centred at island X. Alright, so going from A to B on a semi-circle about this island X. Then it travels along a straight path from B to C. B to C, straight path, okay? Uh, which of these graphs best shows the ship's distance from island X as it moves along its course? Um, so I quickly just resketch the graphs here in the question. So this is uh, what distance travelled and distance from X. So the question is, whew, as the ship goes along this strange journey, uh, we want to graph its distance from the island X. All right, which of these graphs is appropriate? Well, one nice thing about sort of questions like these, when they give me a selection of answers, I can actually employ strategy number six, which is eliminate incorrect choices. Which of these graphs are obviously wrong? If I just get rid of them out of the way, well, I guess half my work will be done. So what can I say right now? So, um, hmm. So this ship goes from A to B, and it's on a semicircle. That means, okay, what's a circle? It's all the points the same distance from the center. So actually, as it goes from A to B, the ship's distance from X is always the same value. It never changes. For the first part of the journey, the ship's distance from X never changes, which tells me this first graph is out. As the ship goes on its journey, its distance here is changing. That's silly. That's out. Uh, this ship's distance is changing on the first part of its journey, but here, the distance of the ship on the first part of its journey is the constant distance, constant distance, constant distance. Right off the bat, 40% of the answers are gone. It's either B, D, or E. Huh, I like that. So, can I eliminate one of these now? Is what, can I, what can I know about going from B to C and what, about its distance from X? Hmm, think about it. Which of these three remaining graphs is correct? I think I can see the answer myself right now. So mull on this, and we think you've got the answer, check the essay that goes with this video. Cool stuff behind this question, actually. All right, thanks so much. Thanks for watching. For more curriculum inspirations material, go to our website. Lots of great stuff there.